Today's video is sponsored by the nice guy who keeps flagging my videos. Open your clip in the fusion page. Disconnect it from the out point, bring a background node in empty space, and connect it to the out point. Add a merge node after the background. Select your original clip node, and bring a particle image emitter node. Next, add a particle custom node, and after that, a particle render node, and connect this render node to the merge as a foreground. This is the full setup for this effect. Go to the particle emitter node, change the lifespan value to 1, and make sure to check the box that says create particles every frame. Set the X density slider to 0.05. If you want less lines, then use a lower value. Select the particle custom node, and go to the particle tab. Find the position Z box, and write down this expression, I will add it in the description so you can copy paste it. As you can see nothing happens yet, but here's the part where you get to flex for the ladies, go to the numbers tab, and by adjusting the number 1 slider, you get this 3D look like effect. If you want to add an extra step to this effect, add a color correction node after the render node, and choose a color for your effect. I really like this effect, so it's going straight for my upcoming pack. If you want to save yourself some time, and also make me rich, get my first pack and never use it.